Genentech is alerting healthcare professionals about two new safety issues for Avastin, or Bevacizumab, a drug used to treat certain colorectal and lung cancers. The first is a rare brain capillary leak problem called reversible posterior leukoencephalopathy syndrome, or RPLS. RPLS is a neurological disorder associated with hypertension, fluid retention, and the cytotoxic effects of immunosuppressive drugs on the vascular endothelium. The onset of symptoms can occur from 16 hours to one year after starting Avastin treatment. And these symptoms can include headache, seizures, visual disturbances, and altered mental function with or without hypertension. MRI is needed to establish a diagnosis of RPLS. The company says that if your patient develops RPLS, you should stop Avastin therapy and start treating the hypertension if it's present. Symptoms of RPLS usually resolve or improve within days, although some patients continue to have ongoing neurological sequelae. It's not known whether it's safe to restart Avastin therapy in patients who've already experienced RPLS. The second safety issue concerns patients on Avastin who've experienced perforation of the nasal septum. Seven cases of this adverse event have been reported since the drug was marketed. For more information, go to our website. Safety TV is brought to you by safetyissues.com. Life has no reset button. Think, Think safety. safety.